I am that I am. Some call me Haru, your modern monk, your cannabis fitness strategist. Back at it again, 24-7, seven days a week. You know how we get in. As the brothers say, get at me. Peace. What's up with y'all? I just have a, I just wanted to get down and dirty with you a little bit. What motivates you? What actually gets you up, wake you up every morning and really take, start taking control of this day or the day ahead of you? What is it that keeps you pushing? What is it that keeps you driving, that keeps you dedicated, that wakes you up? Is it money or is it the opportunity to shine? Is it the opportunity to be living a successful life, a healthy life, a fit life? What is it that gets you up, that wakes your butt up every day, that wants you to, you know, that is right there at your grasp? Is it your children? Is it your spouse? You know, what is it? Is it a friend? Is it a family member? What is it that gets you hype? That gets you motivated. That gets you just want to dig down deep inside and keep you pushing to go for that goal or that dream. What is it? Talk to me. I want to know this. These are the things that I think really when, when those of you who are really serious about your fitness and serious about your health, that's what wakes you up. You feel what I'm saying? Most of us <laughs> keep it real with you, even the pros. Most of them, I mean, you don't love working out. You see what I'm saying? You don't love working out, but you love the benefits of working out. What is it actually doing for you? You feel what I'm saying? It's driving, it's putting you, it's making things more clear. That's why I'm a big promoter of meditation, reflexation, <laughs> reflection. You see what I'm saying? Taking time to quiet the mind. Taking time to quiet the pineal gland or the psychic gland or the heart. Listen to the heart. That's where all your thoughts are coming from. You feel me? <laughs> so what is it that wakes you up? What is it that motivates you? What is it that has you dedicated to drive, to get up and be active? Stay active. Stay in the field. Dominate your field. What is it? You feel what I'm saying? And that's the question today. What is it that makes you get up and move? That makes you get up and live a better day and live a better day that you lived yesterday? You see what I'm saying? We don't think about what's going to happen in the future. Usually, we think about what we're doing now. What are you doing now to get you up, to get you moving? To get your fitness on point. To get your health on point. That's the question. You feel what I'm saying? It's all in your hands. It's all in your control. It's all in you, my brother. My sister. You feel what I'm saying? Take advantage of it. Take control of it. And I'm going to ask you one more time. What is it that wakes you up? That gets you so dedicated to wanting to win in life? To want to succeed in life? To want to be somebody. Hmm? As your boy would say. Be somebody. Hmm? Because you are somebody. It's just people don't know you. Right? People don't know you. Only your intermittent. Or your <laughs> intertwined circle. Only your intermittent circle. You feel what I'm saying? But I'm asking you. What is it that wakes you up? What is it that keeps you going, keeps you driving, keeps you want to keep on getting out there in the gym, keep you want to keep on on that calisthenic game? You feel me? That's what is real. You feel what I'm saying? That's what's going to keep you active, keep you clear, keep your eyes clear, keep your mind clear, keep your heart clear, keep your nose clear. You feel me? Keep you from getting sick. That's the motivation. I mean, I can't motivate you. You have to motivate your own self. You feel me? So what's waking you up? And I'm going to end it right there. Under four minutes. Four minutes and some seconds. I get up with you. Much love. Peace to the universe. Peace to the mother. My yacht. Always. Hotel.